All right, so once you have it paired, uh, your phone to the radio, um, to the Bluetooth, your app radio screen should look like this. It's going to turn into where it says plug it in, basically. It's ready to be plugged to the radio. You're not going to be able to do this until you connect to the Bluetooth first. This is where I got stumped because I didn't see this in any video. Um, make sure when you turn on your radio, flip it over. Go to, let's see if I can, the screen's kind of bright. Um, hopefully you can see that pretty clear. You got to go to settings. And app connection settings, it's going to say, it's going to be set factory to iPhone. Okay, You're going to have to change this. There's only two options, iPhone and other. You have to change this to others or your full mirroring is not going to work. Your, your connection is not going to recognize it as an Android. Um, it's just for S4s or you know any Samsung phone, um, specifically the S4 because that's what I have. So once you do that, then you can go back to the home screen, and your apps button is going to look like that. Now, with my phone in particular, I have to plug it in twice, which means I plug it in, take it off and I plug it back on again because right now it doesn't recognize that it's supposed to be hooked up to a um, Android so watch this it's gonna let me plug it in real quick okay so the first time you plug it in it says HDMI connected and you missed that the screen's gonna come up but you're not gonna be able to press OK you go back now it recognizes that it's an Android Wait a minute. So, like I said, in particular, my phone, I have to unplug it and plug it back in now that it recognizes us is hooking up to an Android. So, let me unplug it, plug it back in. Okay. Now, you see, it, I can press the OK button now. For whatever reason, sometimes you might have to do that. So, now this is what the app radio um, app looks like if you don't have full mirroring um, yeah so pretty much from here I can just since I have my phone rooted and I have the app radio unchained I can basically just oh I didn't want to do that I can just go back it's this is asking I know it's hard to see Sassin, are you sure you want to quit the application? Yes. Now I'm at my home screen and pretty much have full mirroring. Um, again, uh, this has been like a couple day process for me so to get everything working. So once you're here, this will work fine. Okay, now this is where my next problem I ran into was I couldn't get my GPS to work. So real quick, um, once you go through the process of rooting your phone, you'll unlock what they call developer options. Um, and the first thing you want to do is go into those options. I don't think you'll be able to do it from this screen. It's probably easier from the phone. Um, basically, just hit menu, um, go to system settings. I'm using Nova Launcher, so it looks a little different. Um, you want to go to more, scroll to the bottom. Like I said, once you root your phone, you'll understand what this means. Um, you'll unlock developer options. You want to click developer options, scroll down to where you see allow mock locations. This is important for the GPS side. You want to click the checkbox for that. Okay. This is going to allow the um, GPS uh, Unchained, the one that you buy, it's like six bucks. It's going to allow that to work. That's really important for the GPS. Um, other than that, man, it's... it's <laughs> This radio, it changes the game for cars. Like, if you...